Hi everyone, I'm Pooja Khan from emofreetherapy.com. I'm an EFT master trainer and advanced EFT practitioner with EFT International. And in today's video, we are going to be tapping. And I have invited Gayatri Kashyap to tap with me on COVID-related stress or anxiety. And I would like to introduce Gayatri. So thank you, Gayatri, for volunteering for this. Uh, thank you very much, Pooja. You're most welcome, and it's really nice to have you here. And I just want to introduce you, Gayatri. So Gayatri is an accredited EFT practitioner with EFT International. She has also done her doctorate in emotional intelligence, mindfulness-based cognitive therapy. Uh, she's a meditation coach as well as an emotional intelligence trainer. So it's great to have you here, Gayatri. And before we start, I just want to give a few I want to talk about a few things for the viewers because it's a live tapping um, demo. So just so that is clear for the viewers. So all of you who are watching this, please take full responsibility for your emotional, mental and physical well-being. This is a demo on emotional freedom techniques, how you can tap for any COVID related issue. Now you can tap along with us if you already know EFT, but if you don't know EFT, you can watch it, but please, uh, be mindful of any kind of triggering content if that comes up you can switch off the video or you can just tap on the points as we'll be doing in the session okay all right Gayatri so shall we begin yeah definitely okay so I'm do ready. you have something great do you have something in mind that you want to work on today I feel COVID has just uh, like it doesn't uh, affect only the lungs it affects the whole body I think the whole family system is affected by COVID. It is not one person, one problem, but I feel the whole family unit and the society as a whole is affected. Yeah, that's true. Mm. Okay. And is this affecting you? Is this something that's bothering you that you'd like to work on right now? Yeah, general uh, uh, stress is there. The stress level uh, which is not uh, seen in the surface level, but I think under, uh, like an undercurrent, it is there inside. Hmm. Okay. All right. And how does that make you feel right now? Is yeah, I feel friends? really, um, I feel really uh, some kind of grief is there. Grief. Okay. Is it low, medium, high? Uh, I think it should be around a seven. Seven. And do you feel it anywhere in your body right now? Yeah, I, I can feel it in my chest. Chest. Can you describe the sensation? It's some kind of, uh, some kind of like getting suffocated. Hmm. Okay, let's begin tapping on that. Yeah, on that side of the hand. Even though I can feel this grief, even though I can feel this grief and this suffocated feeling in my chest and the suffocated feeling in my chest I deeply and completely accept myself I deeply and completely accept myself even though I can feel this grief even though I can feel this grief and I have this suffocated feeling in my chest and I have a suffocated feeling in my chest I deeply and completely love and accept myself I deeply and completely love and accept myself even though I have this grief even though I have this grief, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely accept, uh, love and accept myself. Yeah, and feel free to change the words anytime you want. Yeah. Okay, top of the head, uh, this grief. This grief. Through the points, this grief. This grief. And this suffocation in my chest. 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 This grief. This grief. This suffocation in my chest. This suffocation in my chest. This grief. This grief. This suffocation in my chest. This suffocation in my chest. Gamut point. This grief. This grief. We'll also be doing the finger points. So the thumb point. This grief. This grief. Index finger. This grief. This grief. Middle finger. This grief. This grief. Little finger, this grief. This grief. All right, just take a deep breath. Breathe in, breathe out.
Just focus on that sensation in your chest. See what's going on there. It's still there. Hmm. I think the intensity is at a six probably. Hmm. Yeah. And, and the thought is uh, coming up is uh, the fear of the future. Fear of the future. All right. So uh, before we go and tap on fear of the future, you had said the grief is about this. There is the whole family getting affected by COVID. Is the grief about that? Or is yeah. it something else? Yeah. yeah, it's about the family because we are basically into business. So uh, all our business is down. Mm. Yeah. So right now, what do you think is more present for you? This grief about family, all our business is down or the fear of the future? What feels more activated or charged right now? Probably um, the business is more important. Hmm. Okay. But let's just tap on that. Even though I have this grief about the family being affected by COVID. Even though I have this fear about the family getting affected by COVID. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Do you want to use uh, this or any other phrase that works for you instead of I love and accept myself? Yeah, I think I love my I love and accept myself. I think that's really nice. Yeah, it is. All right. Even though I have this fear about my family. Even though I have this fear about my family. The business getting affected. The business getting affected. All our businesses are down. All our businesses are down. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I have this grief and fear about my family. Even though I have this fear and grief about the family. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and uh, completely love and accept myself. Okay. This grief about the family. This grief about the family. All our businesses is down. All our businesses is down. This grief about the family. This grief about the family. This fear. This fear. This grief about family. This fear. Uh, this grief about the family. This fear about the family business being down. 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 Okay, breathe in and breathe out. It's coming up and how's your chest right now? My chest pressure has gone down, but still there's fear because both my uh, sons are having um, bronchial problem. Okay. So um, I'm really a uh, little concerned about uh, uh, since uh, COVID is affecting the lungs, they have weak lungs. So I'm really concerned about that. Okay. And the pressure, how much is that in your chest? Now it's come down to a five. Five, yeah. And uh, the fear about the family business, the grief that is no longer that uh, present on the surface or that's also? Uh, actually, there. when we tapped, only this came up next. This, came this up. thought came up like... Hmm. So actually, it's. I think there is a lot of uh, fear which is piled up. So I think each one is surfacing which when we tap. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So this specific fear would be your concern about your sons because they have bronchial problems. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. Even though even I am though, concerned about my sons. Even though I am concerned about my sons. They have bronchial problems. They have bronchial problem. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love myself. Even though I'm afraid for both of my sons. Even though I'm afraid for both of my sons. They have bronchial problems. They have bronchial problems. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I have this fear for both of my sons. Even though I have fear for both of my sons. I'm concerned about them. I'm concerned about them. Because they have bronchial problems. Because they have bronchial problems. 
I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Yeah. I'm concerned for both of my sons. I'm concerned about both of my sons. I'm concerned about both of my sons. I'm concerned about both of my sons. They have bronchial problems. They have bronchial problems. I'm concerned about both of my sons. I'm concerned about both of my sons. They have bronchial problems. They have bronchial problems. I'm afraid for my sons. I'm afraid for my sons. I'm concerned for my sons. I'm concerned for my sons. They have bronchial problems. They have bronchial problems. I'm afraid and concerned about my sons. I'm afraid and concerned about the son, my sons. Would you like another round on this? Yeah. Yeah. So we'll just continue. I'm afraid about I'm afraid them. about my sons. I'm concerned about them. I'm concerned about them. They have bronchial problems. They have bronchial problems. Since COVID affects the chest. Since COVID affects the chest. I am afraid for them. I'm afraid for them. Because they have bronchial problems. Because they have bronchial problems. This fear and concern for both of my sons. This fear and concern for both of my sons. This fear and concern for both of my sons. This fear and concern for both of my sons. This fear and concern for both of my sons. This fear and concern for both of my sons. Okay, breathe in, breathe out. How's your chest right now? I think it's come down to a four. Yeah. So what is coming up now is uh, my my son, elder son has graduated. He has joined his job. So uh, I'm in a, I'm not in a position whether to ask him to go for the job or to stay at home. Okay. So it's, it's, a, it's a little confusion regarding whether to allow him to go or to stay at home. And uh, when does he have to go for it, if he had to? No, he has, he finished graduation six months back, so okay. he's working now. So, that's the concern about him. All right, we'll take it up. But before that, just checking with concern about both of your sons, the bronchial problem, I, is your... Is that there? Is that present yeah. right now? Yeah, because he is having bronchial problem, and uh, him going out to work, whether uh, he is more vulnerable, so uh, whether to ask him to go to work or to make him stay at home, because uh, that also is not correct to make him stay at home. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So right now the concern is about your elder son. Whether yes. or not he could go. Okay. And how much is it? What is the intensity that you feel about this? Uh, for that problem, I think it's a nine. It's a nine. Yeah. So, right now, the grief, how is that? All that has come down. Uh, but the thing is, when I think of my son, I'm a um, little concerned because he has to meet a lot of people. And uh, uh, how careful he will be. That's also a big concern. Okay. Okay, so there are two, three aspects in this. Yeah. Yes. All right. We'll, we'll uh, tap on that and then see which one is more present for you. All right. Okay. okay, side of the hand. Even though I'm concerned about my elder son. Even though I'm concerned about my elder son. I'm confused whether or not he should go for his job right now. I'm confused or not whether he should go for a job or not. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm concerned about my elder son. Even though I'm concerned about my elder son. Because he's more vulnerable. Because he's more vulnerable. He'll be meeting more number of people. He'll be meeting more number of people. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I'm really concerned about my elder son. 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 
and i'm confused whether or not he should go for the job i'm really confused whether he should go for the job or not i'm really confused whether he should go for the job or not i'm really confused whether he should go for the job or not i'm concerned about him I'm concerned about him he is vulnerable he is vulnerable i'm concerned about him i'm concerned about him because he'll meet a lot of people because he'll meet a lot of people i'm concerned about him i'm concerned about him because he'll meet a lot of people because he'll meet a lot of people and i'm confused i'm confused whether or not he should go for the job whether or not he should go for the job okay breathe in breathe out so what i'm thinking is i think he should not be in fear i think he has to go out and he must learn to take care of himself okay all right and uh, how about that vulnerable he is vulnerable and that was at a 9 for you yeah now it has just come down to a 3 okay okay and uh, all right so let's tap on this and anything in your body right now guys three any chest yeah i think suddenly everything is uh, reduced now after this round of tapping okay all right side of the hand um even though even though my son is vulnerable even though my son is vulnerable and that was bothering me and that was bothering me right now i'm feeling that right now i'm feeling that he must not be in fear he must not be in fear he should take care of himself he should take care of himself and i deeply and completely love and accept myself and i deeply and completely love and accept myself even though i feel that he must not be in fear uh even though i feel that he must not be in fear and he should take care of himself he should take care of himself and that he can go for the job and he can go for the job I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Okay. Even though I feel even though I feel that my son can go for the job, um my son can go for the job, he must not be in fear. He must not be in fear and he should take care of himself. And he must take care of himself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Anything you want to change in all of this or does that sound right yeah, i think yeah. it's correct right. it's just yes. okay he must not be in fear he must not be in fear he can go for the job he can go for the job i feel he should take care of himself i think he should take care of himself i think he should take care of himself i think he should take care of himself he must not be in fear he must not be in fear he can go for the job he can go for the job and he should take care of himself he must take care of himself he must take care of himself take care of himself he must take care of himself he must take care of himself looks like it's resonating for you shall we do one more round yes yeah he must he should take care of himself he should take care of himself he must take care of himself he must take care of himself he doesn't have to be in fear he need not be in fear he need not be in fear he need not be in fear he can go for his job go for his job he need not be in fear he need not be in fear he can go for his job he can go for his job and he must take care of himself 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 all right take a deep breath okay how's your chest totally at peace now wonderful but let's do some testing okay yes all right so the three how how is that three he that was there the intensity of three i think now it is almost gone okay all right so just a little bit is remaining and your chest kai three that's also completely gone Okay, I'll just uh, check with you. So we started with 
the grief about the family and yes. the business yeah. how is that right now what's going on there i think uh, among everything i think the first priority goes to my son because um, that was the that was at the highest intensity underneath Hmm. probably other things are there but they are not so very important uh, compared to my son so i think uh, since this came up correctly i think once that is uh, handled i think everything else has gone down okay okay all right so yeah it was like a uh, peeling the onion we kind of kept tapping and coming yeah. to what was causing the intensity about all of this so that's the beauty of eft you yes. keep getting more and more specific about what's really bothering you but let's shall we do one more round on just that remaining intensity or kind of like a positive round if you want to add yes, something yes yes i definitely want to do one more one more round on this yeah so what would you like to add in this round is there anything you want to specifically add or shall we just say he must take care of himself uh he doesn't have to be in fear he can go for the job yeah i think i think everyone should remain healthy and uh, i think uh, that is what we need to take care of ourselves okay. everyone needs to take care of themselves and uh, rather than fear we should know how to handle everything that's it did that bring up any intensity no okay side of the hand even though my chest is feeling relaxed right now even though my chest is feeling relaxed right now i deeply and completely love and accept myself i deeply and completely love and accept myself even though i feel that my son must take care of himself even though i feel that my son must take care of himself and he can go for the job and he can go for the job i deeply and completely love and accept myself i deeply and completely love and accept myself even though i think that we should all take care of ourselves even though i feel that all of us should take care of ourselves and too much fear doesn't help and too much fear doesn't help handling everything um, can help handling everything can help i deeply and completely love and accept myself i deeply and completely love and accept myself okay we should all take care of ourselves 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 uh excessive fear doesn't help excessive fear doesn't help instead handling situations as they come can help you can change it according to what works for you um handling situations as they come okay handling situations as they come can help handling situation as they come can help and we can all take care of ourselves 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 yeah. and excessive fear doesn't help cuz if fear doesn't help anything you want to add kaitri i think you should uh, eat and sleep and do exercise well yeah, yeah. do our exercise yeah. yeah we should eat well sleep well and do our exercise yes we should eat well sleep well and do our exercise well and take care of ourselves and take care of ourselves okay take a deep breath how are you feeling feel completely relaxed okay okay that's really good So is it okay to close the session on this right now? Yeah. Okay. All right. So thank you so much Gayatri for yeah this uh, session it was great to tap with you and I'm sure people will benefit from it. I must thank you Pooja really I think uh, I didn't think the the problem was that simple because the I didn't know where the intensity was and I think you nailed it correctly and so I think uh the minute it got nailed i think all the other uh, grief just vanished okay yeah yeah that's what eft can help with because initially it's difficult to know where is the intensity coming from so just tapping 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 we keep filtering and i'm glad it was helpful yeah thank you very much you're most welcome and thanks for yeah. being a part of this